Hey guys, welcome to Nerdarchy for Nerds by Nerds. I'm Ted, hanging out with the crew here. Dave. Nate. And uh, for, for those of you who have been hanging out with us for a while, you know what this is. For those of you who have just found us for the first time, this is a place for us to put everything we did in the past week in one place. If you missed it, if you somehow didn't, didn't see it, or you want to jump jump back to you know the thing you like the most, all the links are down below. Go, go, check, go check it out, and you can uh, you know see what it is we did. So... First thing off, you know, Nate over there is doing his his subreddit. We uh, we got the the numbers climbing over over on us, uh, you know, Nerdarchy subreddit. How to stay nerdy. Um, if you wanna if you wanna help us out, you can check out our our, our Patreon account. Even a dollar a month is gonna go a long way to helping us bring you guys new and better content. Speaking of uh, you know, bring you guys content. If you happen to have a problem with your game. Um, and you want to submit a GM911 to us, you can send it to nerdarchy at gmail.com. This is a, a situation where if you have a, a problem in your game, you know, for the, 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 that's ongoing situation... That you want help with. That you yeah. want help with, you know, right away. We, we kind of take these as top priority, so we, we'll get it out to you quickly. Yeah, they're, they're not your standard video suggestion. This, right. is, this is like, okay, I have an ongoing game... And this is going to be coming up. Right, and it's a specific problem that you want our take on, our feedback on. We, we discuss it. We give you, you know, a handful of different solutions or, you know, different different opinions so that, you know, even if your players are watching, you know, they've got the ability to not know exactly how you're going to take, you know, the, the situation. And you'll get about 50 to 100 other suggestions. <laughs> in the comments In, in the comments, yeah. In the comments. So, um, there's that. Uh, over on nerdarchy.com... Uh, we, we've got a thing uh, where if you want to try out Audible for free, it's a, a way to, to get you know those those audio books. Uh, you know, Nate and I have both checked it out. It's good stuff. It, it, it's really awesome, and, and it's a, it's a free trial. So if you want a month of free audio books, just go click the link and, and check it out. Yeah, I also put it uh, the link below so you guys can get right to it. Right, absolutely. Um, Something that we're uh, we're doing for uh, the local crowd. We're we're still in the in the planning phase, but we're gonna gonna offer up a nerd barbecue. Um, so basically, we're gonna have a barbecue for the people that are you know in the area. Uh, and right now, we're just kind of looking at you know what kind of interest we have. Yeah. So so what we're probably gonna do is um, if you're from uh, the South Jersey area, Washington Lake Park is a huge park with tons of stuff, tons of room, all kinds of playgrounds. Um, you know, volleyball courts, uh, uh, base, uh, baseball fields, soccer fields, they've got it all. We're going to rent a pavilion for the day. And what we're probably going to do is sell tickets for like five bucks. More than anything, we're, we're going to do the tickets so we have a head count and know, you know how many people expect expect how much food how much we food have to buy. yeah how much food we have to have on hand that kind of thing and it's just a way for us to get together and interact socially you know who knows i, I wouldn't be surprised if uh, like impromptu games break out <laughs> uh, of fifth edition or you know people start whipping out uh uh board games or magic the gathering or, or whatever your nerdy just, thing is just whatever but we, we want to you know we want to get an interest so i mean if, if you if it's something that you know you're be willing to travel, you know, however far to come to that. Please let us know so that we can begin gauging your yeah, know, interest level. We're, uh, just so you have an idea, we're about 20 minutes outside of Philadelphia. Right. Um, so, over on the YouTube channel, you know, people give us uh, suggestions all the time for videos that we've already done. There is a search feature that you can specifically search inside of Nerdarchy. Do you want to tell yeah, them exactly yeah, what that's at? Yeah, every, every um, YouTube channel has its own search feature outside of YouTube itself. So if you go to the to the home page of a channel, you know you, you know you have home videos, pl uh, playlists uh, about. Well, right next to the about tab, there's actually a search bar. Just type in whatever you're looking for. And, and you can uh, probably find it. Most of the uh, uh, replies we do in comments happens from our cell phones. So it's really hard for us to grab links and, and put them in there. Uh, but generally, if you go to that search feature, um, it'll take you to what, whatever you're looking for. If we've done it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, fr fr uh, friends of ours or you know, fellow, fellow YouTubers uh, have recently put out over on uh, Drive Through RPG or RPG Drive Through. One of those. Um, I always get it backwards. <laughs> uh, they they did a uh, mu a mundane list of 
cool items that you can throw out there. Uh, it's Ogre Smith Productions. You know, did did this really cool uh, list. Right now, it's absolutely free. They, they're talking about it being the first um, in a series that they want to want to do. We we read through it. We actually did a review on it. It's really cool. It's only twenty items, and hey, it's free. So go check it out. Um, you know, uh, so that oh, uh, fr uh another you for, you almost forgot the MG info. I almost forgot the MG info. Uh, our friend, our friend down under, our, our friend over in Australia. He's got a really awesome channel out there, and YouTube kind of he's out there wrestling crack. And I was just trying to survive, and you're gonna forget him. I can't believe it. Uh, yeah, he had a yeah. YouTube glitch. He had a YouTube glitch. It caused him to lose all his subscribers. All his videos went to a pay per use or pay per view type of situation. Uh, he's got the got the thing fixed. He's got his channel back up and running. His subscriber base is growing, but he's nowhere near what he used to be. So if you happen to be, um, you know, a, a subscriber of his and you one wondered where his videos went, that's what happened. So go check out his. But there's link. an easy fix. You can go back to his channel and you can resubscribe. Again, the link is below. If you're a crafter and you want to get into the uh, you know the dungeon tile system he's got you know really fantastic videos that are up there go check it out if it's not for you send it to a friend who, who might be so all of that other stuff aside on to the content over on nerdarchy.com uh, I did a, a, a board game review for Settlers of Catan dice game it's a fantastic game I like that game it, it's it's really has the feel of the actual board uh, board game without the, the the same timetable. You can get through a game in about 15, 20 minutes. The play is fantastic, and it still feels like the game. I absolutely love it. Go check out the review. Um, and then we also have a custom path for Barbarian, the the Path of the Primal. I thought it was really cool. It's the you know the next in my series of trying to round. You might up. be a little biased though. <laughs> You know, author Chad Adams. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I wrote it. You know, whatever. Some some people like it, some people don't. That that's for you to decide. Off to you. No, it's awesome. Check it out. Oh, so what do we got? We got uh, okay. Nerdarchist Ryan, my brother. Don't roll dice like my brother. Uh, did uh, Jim Henson uh, fantastic films? Uh, he's he's a three dimensional artist, so he draws a lot of inspiration from those guys that make puppets. And he's going to tell you all about that over in that article. While in the meantime, he's working on some uh, three-dimensional illustrations, which may be a little bit different than what you're used to, but it's still going to be uh, the, the whimsical and fantastical. I think you guys will like it. Uh, we also have... Uh, create what is it the creation myth of virium which that is your campaign world mm -hmm. uh, yeah. custom campaign world that you've only been working on for like 50 years or something i started it's it almost like 15, ready 15 years ago <laughs> i put it on uh you know the back burner for a real long time simmer you know yeah it's, it's been perfection. on simmer yeah Mwah. but i think 5e is a good it's going to be a good uh good fit for it a good fit for it nice you guys can go check that out you also did your part two of the top 10 anime series to check out when writing fiction. Yes. So that's over there as well. Um, Off over, to the YouTube channel. Over to the YouTubes where we do, you know, videos like this one you're watching right now. So uh, we had a GM911 help my help my D and D players want to farm and create non adventuring lives. <laughs> which is doing really well over there. It's got like over over eleven hundred views already. Which is I'm totally blown away by. <laughs> uh, we did one of our fast and dirty monsters, uh, giant four armed gorilla. Uh, we did uh, we did something a little bit different. We did uh, laser tag, nerf paintball, and other war games in our not D and D series. We also have from the wilds feral D and D character concepts. With that, I'm gonna hand it off. All right. <clears throat> so we have sandbox versus railroad. Uh, free range RPG characters. It's okay. Uh, Virium fantasy modern futuristic D and D campaign setting overview. That was the world building that you know it did well enough that I said, oh yeah, I'll write an article about this very subject. Uh, then we have player characters and positions of power in your campaign world, uh, being like mayor or you know on the council or something, uh, creating tension and adding threats in a tabletop D and D uh, game or well 
tabletop RPG game. I'm just sticking D&D in his stuff. Uh, and then we have D&D Eyes, Thor from the Avengers characters. Uh, creating a halfling cleric, unorthodox character builds. And taking the Dragonborn home, the live 5e D&D game. So, Which hey. I actually got to play in. <laughs> Which you actually got to play in. <laughs> Woohoo! Yes, the no, Nerdarchist Ted was off at Steampunk. He did so, not get to play in it. Uh, he was no. steampunking. Indeed. So, so that's everything from last week. So until next time, stay, stay nerdy. nerdy.